Hey guys, Path of Gaming right here, right now, and we're climbing again. We are D1, I think 23 LP, something like that. Something like that. And yeah, we need like two wins to get into Master. So maybe like three, four games and we'll get there. And I've been asked to comment more on why I scout and what I'm scouting for. So I shall do that. So if you guys are are interested in why I scout and what I scout for, then this is the, the VOD for you. And obviously, if you have any questions, you can you can write them down below on this YouTube video. You can write them on my Discord, which is also in the in the comment section of this video, or sorry, on the description of the video. So all that good stuff is available. And we have two master players, and we only have, oh, a D3. Probably smurfing, but otherwise it's D1s. So it should be pretty good. Should be pretty good. So I think I'm going to go for... It's either sword or armor. Like I think sword or armor are still the best starts. And very close behind that is tier. Yeah, that's what I have right here. Chain, sword, tier. So that's what I'm going to go for. So I think uh, I can grab... Oh, there's two, two armors. I'll grab one, one of them. Well, nobody's going for the armor. It's always good to go. I, I think armor is still good enough. Wow, you don't want an armor? You, yeah, you do want the armor. I think armor is one of the better starts, but yeah, maybe they don't. So maybe I'll learn. Maybe I'll learn to adapt and have a better start. But for now, I think armor is really good. So now I'm going to look for pairs. If I can buy any pairs or uh, chosen or anything, I will do that. So I have a pair of Wukongs. It's fine. And for backline, I have a TF. And obviously I can just buy out the whole shop. So yeah, we just bought the whole shop and we have uh, frontline options and DPS option, which is TF. And we just scout for to see, okay, Warlord Keeper, I just want to see what other people are playing. Okay, so there's a lot of Warlords. Warlords and Keepers. So I probably don't want to play Warlord. If I get a Warlord chosen, I'll take it, obviously, because they're super strong. But if I can get something else, it would be better. So we did get the two-star Wukong. So, but we, we can actually get the armor off. The question is, do I want to get the armor off the Wukong? So I can just take this Wukong out, right? So I can consider taking the armor off based on what I get here. If I get if I get a Sunfire Cape, I will just leave the armor on the Wukong. I got a Sunfire Cape, so I don't mind having armor on Wukong. Right, so I can just slam this on fire cape. We are probably going to pivot into fortune. I wish I had picked up the. I should have picked up the. Um, what's her face? The Nidley. That was my bad. And I didn't scout. I did not scout. That's my mistake. So I'm just positioning, like general positioning. And I don't have a chosen anyway, so I should I should have leveled up. I think, I think I should have leveled up since I don't have a chosen. Yeah, if I had leveled up there, I could have won here. But yeah, man, talking is hard. Talking is hard. Like talking through my my thought process. Anyway, now that I lost, I don't really care, so I'm not going to level up.
Yeah, I don't know what this opener is, but... I think I can do this. Actually, yeah, it's better. So it's an Elderwood opener. With mages. So now we just need Vygar. Alright. Or we can just go this. Alright, I should be scouting. Uh, Moonlight, Divine. I mean, the Sandfire Cape is, is doing the best it can. So we're going to go for a Lost Streak. There's the Vigar. There's the Lulu. Huh. And there's a uh, Annie. Good enough. There's also a hacker rim here. Uh, I should have put the Annie in front. That's a mistake. That is a mistake. But this guy is full win streak, nice. <laughs> okay, so can I get a tier here? If not, I can go Deep Scops Vigar is kind of bad, but tier is fine, Rod is fine, Sword is fine. I'm getting a tier, most likely. Oh, he should get a tier, actually. He could get a tier. He could have potentially gone for the tier. He could have potentially gone for the tier. I think Ludens is quite powerful on the Teemo, but I guess he's going for something else. Uh, for 10 gold? I mean, it wouldn't be bad, but there's only there's only one other Maokai, right? So I'm going to try to 3-star the Maokai. If I can. So if I if I can three star the Maokai, I'm gonna three star the Maokai because I think I think it's worth it, right? Wait, I gotta I gotta play more NCS sounds. Yeah. So I I think I think three starting the Maokai is, is the is the right play. Can we just thank you, play some Ah. Obviously this positioning is terrible, but I wanted to move my units at the same time. I wanted to play music which is which is not going to be banned by by YouTube. So, yeah. So there's the fortune option, right? It's just something to keep in mind. I don't think I want to play fortune right now. So I will either sell the TF or just chill. Right, so I would start playing Fortune if I was losing, but since I'm winning, playing into Fortune would be a dumb, dumb thing to do.
So I know I can sell this. So either I sell these two or I buy the Katarina. So I mean, I can get Fortune in, I guess. I would have to level up to six though to get Fortune in. Because I cannot drop the Elderwoods, right? I cannot drop anything. Okay, we got enough gold. Uh, we, we buy the Katarina for sure. Never mind, I lied. So now I'm scanning to see what, what side I should have my, uh, and I sh it should go this side because there's a Z player. So <coughs> I should put Vygar here, away from the Z player. Okay, now I'm looking for a fortune. If I can hit a fortune, I'll be happy. There we go, we hit a fortune, right? Um, we have enough front line, so we can put this in instead of Annie. No, we hit the fortune, idiot. So we play the fortune. And as I was saying, I was scouting to see where the Zeds are. And there's the Zeds over... Okay, the Zeds is gone? No, the Zeds over here. Zed over here, okay. I can sell this, 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 this. Um, so I cannot sell anything, essentially. I want to protect, I want to protect my Vigar from Zed. Yeah. I'm gonna roll a little bit. Do I want to roll? No, I don't want to roll. I'm gonna sit on 50. I can sit on 50 for now. Wait, let's see. How strong this guy beat this guy? This guy's okay. -ish. This guy's kind of strong. Uh, where's the Z guy? Oh shit, he has three star. Okay, I don't think I beat him. Like I want, I want to protect my front line, right? I mean, I want to protect my, my Vigar. Use my frontline to protect my Vigar. Lulu, come on! <laughs> That's a nice win. Can I get a tier here though? That is the question. Uh, and the answer is no, I cannot get a tier. Can I get a rod? No, I cannot get a rod. This is going to be a very tough Vicar game. So I'm probably going to go, I'm probably going to go for Ash then. Since I can make a death blade. So I'm going to make the Hodge. I'm going to make the Hodge right now. And I'm going to go for, for Ash instead of Vigar. So that's a, that's a de decision I made based on the items I got, right? Uh... 
Like if I could have gotten a blue buff, I would go for, for blue buff comp, but since I cannot get a blue buff. I can also, you can also position into. Wait, um, yeah. Into the Z. That's one way to beat Z if you position into the Z. Okay, three star Philios. I think Jinx is better, so I put in the Jinx. Okay, so selling to 10 would have been better. Now I see that selling to 10 would have been a lot better. But it is what it is. You see how the Zed kind of got stuck on the Maokai? So even though he finally killed him, but he got stuck on the Maokai. I can actually win this. And this would have been very hard to win. Otherwise. I think it's just gold, right? Yeah, it's just gold. Which is actually okay. Like, I got... A fuck ton of gold. So in theory, three-star Maokai is not bad, but in practice, it, it's whatever. Since I didn't hit him anyway, didn't hit him. Didn't hit him fast enough. No, I don't know. Moving around my bench is it's, it's more important. Moving around my bench is super important right now. Don't you know anything, man? It's always move around your bench units. All right, we got the hex tech. Uh, we sell all of this. Now yeah, we can scout now. Warlord, Spirit, Keeper, Moonlight, Spirit, Warlord. Aphelos is gone. And Vagar got me. Lulu two, another Vigar. Okay, we got a roll for that, I guess. That's fine. What the hell? I don't want any of this shit. Now, I will take the Emperor, though.
No! <laughs> Fine, I'll take a loss. Doesn't matter. Still have fortune in. Yeah. Should probably position this in the front. This more front as well. Position this a little bit better. Like here, 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 here. Have this here, here. I actually think six other would be better than three. Yeah, six other would actually be a little bit better here than just having fucking three, but whatever. So I get another, okay, I have a belt, I have a sword, so I can get a GA, G on the cane, but that's not gonna happen, so I can go for a ZZ rod, I guess. Zephyr then? This is bullshit. I'll go for this. I think um, Warbox is actually kind of decent. Yeah, just not being able to hit really. Oh, there we go. For fuck's sake. Was that so hard? Okay, wait, what am I playing? This, yes, this, no, no, no. Okay, warm hogs, here you go. Still haven't hit the three star Maokai, so I'm just gonna go fast nine. I thought I would have Maokai to go fast nine with, but I didn't get him, so boo fucking who. Okay, bye bye to this guy. Oh, he's still alive. Good for him. No thieves gloves, nothing, just gold. Uh, you don't like my Mao collection? What the hell? But this is why you never go for three stars, because it's useless, and you just fuck yourself, you grief your econ, and you don't hit the three-star Maokai anyway. And even if I do hit the three-star Maokai, it's kind of like whatever. So yeah, that's why that's why you should never go for three stars. So yeah, keep that in mind. What the fuck? Nice Ari there. Holy shit. Good chosen spirit Ari. Okay. I got shit on. He's getting shit on as well. It's good. Uh, top four has not been secured yet. Uh, I think I cut the... Wait, oh my god, I sold the Lilia because I'm a fucking idiot. Selling the Lilia was actually really stupid there because I need the Lilia for Mage when I want to dump Annie. And I want to dump Sejuani as well for some legendaries. I will do that on 5-2. I still have the Death Blade. Deathblade QSS. It 
It could have been an Elderwood spat, which would be better because I'm an idiot. I, I saw the QSS. Yeah, man. So many mistakes. So many mistakes. I can't level up here because it's too expensive. So I have to wait after Carousel. I might die. Yeah, Lilia was, yeah, the Mao collection really is not doing anything for me. Okay, I should put Lulu more in the front so she actually does stuff. Good idea, thank you. So let's position this a little bit better. We put this here, this here, this here, here, here. This can go in the front. This is completely useless now. This is completely weak as well. So yeah, we are fucked. Um, I need to survive two more levels, which might, which might be pretty difficult to be honest. But uh, yeah, we can pray that I do. Let's pray that I do survive two, two more rounds. I can kill the Zed easily. He's going to jump in and he's going to get killed. Told you guys. Yeah. Cashing out again on 2Fortune. Oh, look at that. We finally two-star the Annie. Cool. We got a Thieves' Gloves. Yay. Who wants Thieves' Gloves? We can put them on the Pony, which we're selling anyway. Uh, we should consider who we're going to keep with Ash. So with Ash, I'm keeping... I'm keeping Kindred with Ash, and I want to find Warwick with Ash. I'm going to play... Something along the lines of Lulu, Ezreal, and Ash. So I want the Lux. Because as we know, Lux fucks. So it's always good to have Lux. That'll fuck. Okay, nice. So that's a Giant Slayer on top of everything. So if I'm not if I'm not fucked without the Giant Slayer on the, on the RE, now I'm definitely fucked. Yeah. Great. Um, we need something for our, for our Ash. Warwick never loses. So let's find something for Ash. Hodge is fine for Ash, I guess. So now finally we're gonna pivot out of this shit. Finally we're gonna pivot out of this shit. We're gonna level up, we're gonna put in a better board. And yeah, you can watch me drop the ball. Who wants to watch me drop the ball? Let's go boys. Time to drop the ball. Let's go. Um, I'm pretty much sure we're going to fuck this up. So yeah, enjoy me fucking this up. And I said I would keep the locks, which I did. Which I said I would keep that, which I did not. I did keep it. And that's how you fuck up a pivot, boys. That's how you fuck up a pivot. So this I don't need. Do I need this? Oh wait, I need Mystic. So that's, that's Mystic. This I don't need. 
Wait, I don't have Elderwood this way, so I do need that. I need something for Elderwood. So this gives me Elderwood. There we go. We got top four somehow. We got top four somehow. Uh, so so we have the QSS and the BT, no, the QSS and the D-Claw. Uh, D-Claw goes on, wait, do we want Warwick carry? So we definitely don't want one star kindred that doesn't do anything. That might be better. Wait, than this. We do want one star kindred. Oh wait, Lee. Okay, well how about we two star the kindred then? The boss. Okay, we definitely want uh, uh, red, red, red. Fuck it, fuck it, and fuck it. Where did the boss go? Where did the boss? The boss didn't go work out. Okay, so that's how you fuck it up. Hope you enjoyed that, guys. Fuck everything up.